Hello friends, this video statistics part 11 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched statistics part 1 to part 10. For example, where we have to find the mean division about median for this value. So the first step we have to do is we have to arrange in ascending order. If you see 2, 12, 5, 8, this is not ascending order. So let's arrange this first in ascending order. Correct. So let me write this. This is x i, this is f i. So the minimum is 2. So I'll write 2 here. 2, 2. Then comes 5. I'll write 5, 8. Then comes 6. I'll write 6, 10. Then comes 8. I'll write 8, 7. Then comes 10. I'll write 10, 8. And then comes 12. So I'll write 12, 5. So now I have this in ascending order. The second step is to find the value of n. n here is or to find a cumulative frequency. To find a cumulative frequency that will give the value of n altogether. So this becomes the cumulative frequency at this point will be 2. Here it will be 2 plus 8, 10. Here it will be 10 plus 10 plus 20. 20 plus 7, 27. 27 plus 8, 35. And this is 40. So that means this is the total number of terms. n is equal to 40. We can directly make out because the last value is the total number of terms. Now, to find median, what we have to do? Since n is equal to 40, so the median term is nothing but n by 2, n by 2 plus 1 because this is even. So that means 10th and 11th term we are looking for. Now from this distribution, we can say that 10th term is in this domain and 11th is in this box. I think I made a mistake here. I think I made a mistake here. n is equal to 40. So this is n by 2 is 20 and n by 2 plus 1 is 21. So I am looking for 20th and 21st term. Let me write again clearly. 20th and 21st term. I am looking for these two terms. So 20th term will be in this in this box and 20th will be in the this box. So I have to take the mean of 6 and 2. Why? Because I am looking for 28th and 21st term. This is still 28th. So 28th will be in this box. 20 onwards is in this box. That means 21, 22, 23, everything is in this box. So 28th term is, I will say 28th term is 6 and 21st term is 8. So the median in my case will be, the median will be nothing but 6 plus 8 divided by 2 that is 7 correct so we have got the median first thing achieved good we have median now now we have median then we can now find mean deviation about median to find mean deviation about median what we have to do we have to find the distances of all these points about median so i have to write x i minus m so Distance of 2 from 7 is nothing but 2 minus 7 mod that comes out to be 5. So this guy is 5. Similarly, distance of 5 from 7 is nothing but 5 minus 7 mod that is nothing but 2. This value is 2. Distance of 6 from 7 is nothing but 6 minus 7 mod that is nothing but 1. So this value is 1. Similarly, distance of 8 from 7 is nothing but 8 minus 7 mod and that is also 1. Similarly, distance of 10 from 7 is nothing but 10 minus 7 mod. Distance of 10 from 7 is nothing but 10 minus 7 mod, that is 3. This guy is 3. And distance of 12 from 7 is nothing but 12 minus 7 mod, that is 5. See, everything if you write in the tabular form, it's very easy to calculate and it's not confusing also. So now I have formed xy minus n. But the formula which I had was was of something of this form. I like the formula. The formula was of this form sigma fi into xi minus m mod right by sigma fi. This was the formula of mean deviation about median. Correct. So we have to find sigma fi xi. So first we have to find fi. This one sigma fi xi minus m. So let's find fi into xi minus m mod. So we will multiply these two values, this and this. 
to make it circle if you want. You multiply these two. So what we will get is nothing but fi into xi minus m mod. This is mod actually. This is nothing but 5 into 2 is 10. 8 into 2 is 16. 6. 10 into 1 is nothing but 10. 7 into 1 is nothing but 7. 8 into 3 is nothing but 24. 5 into 5 is nothing but 25. This becomes total if you add, this becomes 25 plus 24, 29. 49, 49 plus 7 is 56, 66, 72, 82, 92. This is 92. So according to formula, MD is nothing but same formula, right? Sigma Fi into Xi minus M by Sigma Fi, where I is equal to 1 to 12. Here also I is equal to 1 to 12. Correct? This is all I. This becomes, this is 92 we found, this value 92 by sigma fi we know is nothing but 40 right if you add this it becomes 40 by 40 so this is our answer so the mean deviation about median for this data is 92 by 40 what we have done the first thing is we found the mean to find the mean we arrange this in ascending order all the xi's once you have this in arranging on here, we found the commutative frequency. It came out to be CF came out to be 40. Since it is an even number, to find the mean, we have to get n by 2 and n by 2 plus 1 that we have learned in the past classes. So we have to find 20th and 21st term. We found 20th term is 60 and 21st term is 8. We took the mean of this to get the median. So median came out to be 7. So once we got the median, now we have found a distance of x i s from median. The distance came out to be this values 5, 2, 1, 1, 3, 5. Once we have a distance, we found fi into the distance. We got distance. We added this to get 92. And then we used the formula. The formula was sigma of fi into xi minus n. That is distance by sigma fi. Where i tends to, i varies from 1 to 12. We put the values and we got the answer as 92 by 4. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.